Hey yo! So I just woke up like what 9:30 right now. What time is it? 10:03. Uh, I'm gonna pack up all my camera gear. I'm heading down to PAX. I'm gonna meet up with Skiva, Alex, and a handful of other people like Jasmine, and get to meet them. And it'll be super fun. We're just gonna be hanging out with the VR community today. Hopefully, maybe, maybe not. We're gonna follow around Skiva, check out PAX, and then they have like a little party that they're throwing tonight. So yeah, let's get all this camera gear. I'm gonna go get a coffee, and I will see you guys down in Seattle. Let's do it. <laughs> What's up? So we were just at PAX, just wandering around doing games. Skiva was doing the Demio booth, and then Betty just showed up. We had dinner and everything. And what'd you think of the, the booth? The Demio booth was super sick. I loved it. And I loved playing Demio with people. It was awesome. Hell yeah. Mm -hmm. It looks super fun and super cool. Saw a lot of cool games, a lot of cool VR games. There was Aspire 2, Demio was there. There was this new AR style game that's on- Zombies Noir. Yeah, Zombies oh. Noir. Mm -hmm. Did you see it? No. Well, here's like a little clip right here. You can check it out of Skiva playing it. Other than that, now we're just headed to the bar and we're gonna go have some drinks and hang out with friends and meet up with people. So yeah. <laughs> Well, I didn't vlog a crazy amount. We did get to meet everybody, and we're gonna go play in the tournament tomorrow. It's the big Vail tournament for the playoffs, so hopefully we do good. And then after the tournament, we're just gonna meet up with everybody again and hang out. Yeah, I'm kinda nervous right now for the playoffs tomorrow, but we'll see how it goes. So for now, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace out. All right, I'm not gonna be, not gonna be streaming today, um, obviously, because I'm just gonna record uh, chat usually gets me all nervous and whatnot. I'm a weirdo, right? So this is where we're gonna be playing today. Got the headset, office. You guys haven't seen the office. This is where I play. And uh, yeah, so I'll show you some highlights now. Depending on how the day goes or morning goes. Morning, we're playing, it's what, nine o'clock right now? Or we start at nine. So it's eight, eight something right now. Uh, I'm gonna get ready, hop in a game, play a little bit. And then here's some highlights for, for the day. And I'll see you in a bit. I don't let Shadowhawk get very far, but Shortstack's also looking for him. Looks like they're gonna try and just commit onto the B site here. Shortstack trying to get involved on Scooby, and he gets him. That's a good pick. But Sayo's coming up behind Vital. Shadowhawk now. Oh, the timing, he just oh. escapes. Oh, oh he no. grabs him. Trade out between the two. He missed his initial shots, gave away his spot. The plant hasn't gone in. That's really important right now, once again. The puck isn't on the last guy standing, so what this means is a little Sainara, if you yeah, identify the puck, you just hold there. Again, time is against Short Stack. Lil Sainara is an intelligent player. He knows that, that the scan hasn't got in, so he can just hold back. He can just wait for the scan to go in, because guess what, ladies and gents? When that scan goes in, it's 45 seconds on the round, so that gives Sainara time to do a retake. So right now, Sai so can do whatever he wants. He can just play with time until that scan goes in. Yeah, short and stack's I think running short out stack of time. firing into the center gives away the fact he doesn't have the puck. Five seconds left on the clock. This will have to be the quickest scan in history. Oh. <laughs> wow. We all hold our breath there. Both me, I, like neither of us had anything to say. Just like, breathe in, can he do it? Oh, not quite. It's last time I was like, like, looking for JD in the center ground. Looks like they're gonna try and rotate towards A now. Short stack really the only one holding it here. JD's gonna come up on three members of boss fight here. Takes down one, but Scooby able to refrag that one. Short stack now the last one standing. Archer flanking round, gonna battle Austin, pick him up. It's all on short stack's shoulders. It's a three versus one. No, it's not actually. Virtual Panda's coming in from behind. Short stack picks up one. He's got the position now. A huge wow, play from short stack. stack. 
They're just holding out. Like, boss fight keep taking the early advantage, and then the swing back happens. There's a really good read by Short Stack. Using the map to give himself a little bit more time and space, and Virtual Panda can rotate and support. Like, big brain play from Short Stack there, holding down A site. Wow. Panda swings out and picks him up, and that's it. Perfect position to lurk through. He's going to battle with Virtual Panda a little bit. Panda has to turn around to deal with them, which is splitting them now. It's a two on three and a one on one at the same time. Archer picks up Virtual Panda. Archer now has to crash in to help out the defenders. Legale is back wide open to Short Stack. The side of fans, it's also Short Stack's shoulders now. Driving comes in and trades out. And Boss Fight take map one. What a match. Homeland almost bringing that back. What are you doing to me? In Archer and Viper just outside, but JD might be waiting for them outside. Three members of Short Boss Fight left. Oh, look, Short Stack is scouting for him. They, I mean, Sai's not got there secretly. Short Stack is on a tight angle looking for that pick. He's trying to battle with Panda, but if he overextends too much, Short Stack's going to delete him. There it is. Short Stack's going to be looking for it. There it is. Wow. What a play by Short Stack. You're right. What a read. Great hole. In and take a point. Stay in this. Boss Fight just needing to hold on for one more point. Looks like Homeland's going to try for a fast A execute here. Short Stack all the way through the tunnels already. He's gonna have to fight Thrywin here. Dave comes through. Flashbang. Short Stack is slightly blind. Hiding in the corner. Battling back. One, they two, just like that. Got the entries. They have numbers on a side. Two versus nothing. But the scan hasn't gone in. There's a guy carrying the scan. Shadowhawk was taken down. The rotate slow to come in from boss fight right now, though. Short Stack's boss gonna be able a three, to three, three, scan. But, uh, boss fight just... Not moving and getting taken down on the wraparound. JD holding back, waiting to ambush anyone. Is he going to get Scooby as well? Good Austin, Austin the ladder here. Oh, he sees Sight, misses Sight. Sight does not have time to engage him. Stopping to engage him anyway. He knows Plus five with about 15 seconds. Rayo finds JD. Scooby oh, finds Austin. Shot it's all up to short stack. Nine seconds. This is so tense. All boss I need to do is get this disabled. Sayonara doesn't even have a gun! What is happening? 11 no, seconds. Wow. Short Stack holds the line, keeps them in it. Homeland, four points. They're still in this, ladies and gentlemen. Boss fight almost taking it away there, but Homeland refusing to give up. What a great play. Well, today sucks <laughs> a little bit. I mean, we won our first two matches, and then we played Boss Fight has Lonely Vipers team. It's got a little Sayonara on there. A little Sayonara was on it yeah we didn't make it boss fight went on and then boss fight played wrecked for the final and wreck took it and wrecked's going to the land finals so it's gonna be wrecked has clev nadix chill step and a few others they're pretty good pretty good so i'm excited to see everybody play at land i'll be there recording and making videos and stuff for the event i'm excited to see everybody we have royal strive that made it yesterday and then today we have wrecked then we have next weekend saturday and sunday to figure out who's going to be the final four for the land final so if you aren't following the ivrl league on uh, twitch.tv slash ivrl league and they also have an ivrl league two i recommend you go check it out for next weekend too first uh, saturdays got vortex and a few other good teams in there Blue cobra cartel i believe and a few others or maybe they're on the fourth i don't know but that weekend's gonna be an awesome weekend to watch from here i would like to go back down to pax but we'll see what happens uh, it depends on where they go and, and stuff so if we do then this transition will be pretty cool hi friends <laughs> <laughs> What's up, dude? How you doing, brother? Good. What's up? Hey. How's it going? No, it's okay. We lost, but it's all good. We're gonna lose, lose the Viper. I know. I know. We better stack. I love it. Good to see you, man. Oh, sweet. Yeah. Thank you. Ah, that's a good. Oh heck yeah! Thank you. So I came back out to move the car, just parking it in a different spot. Figured I'd put the camera down. Everybody seemed tired. I didn't want to put a camera in their face, but we were going to probably head somewhere. I freaking forgot my damn debit card at the arcade bar last night, the barcade. So I got to go pick that up and then we'll be headed to a party with a few devs and stuff like that. So if I take any more recordings, it will most likely be on my phone so I don't have to lug around this camera anymore. So it's probably not going to be the best quality but whatever right so yeah let's go let's go party